Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to be discussing flowers that correlate with each personality in the MBTI. If you're not familiar with the MBTI, it's the world's most popular personality assessment. If that sounds interesting to you, go ahead and check it out. I think one of the most popular ones is 16 personalities. Go to 16personalities.com to take your own. Find out more about yourself and what flowers correlate with you. First up is ISTJ. ISCJs are represented by the rose, which symbolizes order, tradition, and reliability, resonating with ISTJs' practical and structured nature. They're also represented by pansies, which represent the thoughtfulness and attention to detail, fitting ISTJs' meticulous approach. Next up is ISFJ. ISJs are represented by Lily of the Valley, which signifies humility and devotion, mirroring ISFJs' nurturing and supportive nature and also carnations, which symbolize love and affection, reflecting ISFJ's caring and dependable nature. Next up is INFJ. INFJs are represented by the forget-me-nots, which represent deep connections and memories, resonating with INFJ's compassionate and empathetic traits, and the iris, which symbolizes wisdom and creativity, fitting INFJ's introspective and imaginative nature. Next is INTJ. INTJs are represented by orchids, with their complex and unique, reflecting INTJ's deep thinking and strategic mindset, and the snapdragons, which symbolize strength and intellect, appealing to INTJ's analytical and logical approach. ISTP. ISTPs are represented by Gerbera daisies, which represent spontaneity and creativity fitting ISTP's adventurous and hands-on personality, and tulips, which symbolizes determination and growth, resonating with ISTP's practical and adaptable nature. Next is ISFP, and they're represented by daisies, which represent innocence and positivity, mirroring ISFP's free-spirited and optimistic outlook, and freesia, which symbolizes spontaneity and friendship, appealing to ISFP's expressive and compassionate nature. Next is INFP, which are symbolized by bluebells, represents humility and gratitude, fitting INFP's introspective and sensitive personality. And cherry blossoms, which symbolize beauty and transience, resonating with INFP's idealistic and imaginative nature. Next is INTP, and they're represented by sunflowers, which symbolize intelligence and vitality, reflecting INTP's curious and analytical mindset, and lavender, which represents introspection, introspection and calm, appealing to INTP's independent and thoughtful nature. Next is ESTP, which are represented by geraniums, which represents strength and determination, fitting ESTP's energetic and adaptable personality, and marigolds, which symbolize courage and passion, resonating with ESTP's bold and action-oriented nature. Next is ESFP, which are often represented by hibiscus, which represents joy and celebration, mirroring ESFP's lively and sociable personality. Next is peonies, which symbolize compassion and prosperity, fitting ESFP's generous and enthusiastic nature. ENFP, represented by wildflower mixes, which represents spontaneity and creativity, reflecting ENFP's energetic and imaginative personality. And Cosmos, which symbolize harmony and balance, resonating with ENFP's idealistic and empathetic nature. ENTP, are represented by Birds of Paradise, it represents freedom and adventure, fitting ENTP's innovative and unconventional approach. Protea, which symbolizes transformation and diversity, appealing to ENTP's analytical and visionary nature. ESTJ, represented by Gladiolus, which represents strength and integrity, mirroring ESTJ's authoritative and responsible personality, and daffodils, which symbolize leadership and determination, fitting ESTJ's structured and goal-oriented nature. 
ESFJ, represented by peonies, which represent compassion and nurturing, resonating with ESFJ's caring and supportive qualities. And hydrangea, symbolizing understanding and gratitude, fitting ESFJ's empathetic and community-focused nature. ENFJ, represented by the rose, which represents love and compassion, mirroring ENFJ's empathetic and inspiring personality. And gardenia, symbolizing purity and grace, resonating with ENFJ's charismatic and nurturing nature. ENTJ, represented by tulips, which represents ambition and determination, fitting ENTJ's assertive and strategic nature. And magnolias, which symbolize dignity and perseverance, resonating with ENTJ's visionary and decisive qualities. And that wraps it up with the 16 personalities. I hope you enjoyed this. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more. And I suggest go taking this personality assessment. It's a great one. It's fun. It's very educating. And most people seem to enjoy it and discover new things about themselves. Until next time.